Now to our big story tonight. Struck by a vehicle and left in a ditch. A woman is hit while out running in Racine County. Tonight, this body camera video shows deputies making the arrest and our Casey Cronus live in Racine County with what we are learning about the suspect here. Casey? The Racine County Sheriff says impairment was a potential factor. If convicted, the suspect could face up to 15 years in prison. I haven't known what to do. And you didn't think to call the police? Because this person is I... flight for life to freighter now. What? Okay. So. Oh my God. Oh my God. Using a broken rear view mirror from the suspect's vehicle, Racine County Sheriff's deputies on Friday night tracked down the alleged driver of a hit and run that left a 36 year old jogger badly injured. It was raining so hard that I don't know what the hell. Just before 630 Friday evening, prosecutors say 34 year old Joshua Hansen struck a woman who was out for a run <laughs> near Highway 45 and County Line Road in the village of Yorkville. But at the end of the day, um, he chose to leave. Sheriff Christopher Schmeling says a witness stopped to help. Thankful to that person out there. The victim was hospitalized in Kenosha, then taken to freighter by flight for life. According to court documents, she suffered a fractured elbow, broken ribs, and a severe eye injury. I told you to go back. Oh okay. my God. So go ahead and uh, put your hands behind your back for me. Meantime, deputies found the suspect and his vehicle at his Union Grove home. He's been arrested and charged with hit and run, causing great bodily harm. This type of behavior in Racine County will not be tolerated. Hansen made his initial appearance in court today and is due back for a preliminary hearing next week. Meantime, the victim is expected to be okay. Reporting live in Racine County, Casey Cronus, Fox 6 News. That is some good news. All right, Casey, thank you for that.